Welcome back to Get Slow with Nicole. I am Nicole. Today we're going to do a high intensity interval Tabata style workout. So we're gonna work really hard for 20 seconds, have a 10 second break, do another exercise for 20 seconds, have a 10 second break, and we're gonna repeat that for a total of eight cycles. Then you have a minute to rest before we start a new round. There are gonna be six total rounds. Then we're gonna finish off with some core work and a cool down. You do not need any equipment for this workout. Your body will provide plenty of resistance. Check out my new Get Swole Top. This is the women's flowy tank and it is so soft. I love that you can wear it loose like I'm wearing it here or you can tie it up if you like a more fitted tank. That's probably how I'll wear it for the workout. Check out our Swole Superstar. This is Melissa. She's been getting swole with us and she's modeling the same top and she said she loves it. So if you have ordered a top, I would love if you would send me a picture and I'll feature you on a future video with your permission. No pressure, of course. All right, guys, let's get started with our workout. Again, you do not need any equipment. We're just gonna start with our warm up. All right, guys, time to move. We are gonna get warmed up together. We're gonna to start with a step touch to the right. Here we go. Step, touch, step, touch. So take big steps, bend your knees a lot, get ready to fire up the legs. Making that hamstring curl, turn your knees out and pull your heels high. Now bend your knees a little more, Start to feel that warming through the hamstrings. Side step to squat, out, in, out. So take a long, take a wide step and push your butt back and down. We're gonna make it a side lunge. So still take a big step. Keep one of your legs straight. Bend the one you land on. Push your butt back and down. Backward stepping lunge. Your right leg steps back, down, up, switch. So giant step and lots of bend in the back knee. One more, we're gonna get ready to walk. Walk forward three steps, lift the knee. Now hamstring curl. Four, three, two, walk forward. Knee up, walk back, hand curl, feet wide. Come again. Now really bend your knees here and dig into the hamstrings. One more. Feet stay wide, slow squat. Sit the butt down and slowly rise. We're gonna do that one more time on our way down to the floor. So sit back, hands down, walk forward to plank with the knees on the floor. Front knee to elbow, hips sit to heels, two push-ups, chest to elbow level. Back knee to elbow, hips to heels, two push-ups. We're using this move to warm the upper body. Lighten up the upper body. We've got two more. This time, this time, no push ups. Walk the hands back, push up to standing, walk to me. Three steps, hand curl, feet wide. All right, guys, time to mentally prepare for a tough workout. We're gonna burn so many calories today. We're gonna burn off some of that stress. You're gonna feel so good by the end. Backward lunge, right leg, step back, down, and again. Can you come a little deeper by bending your back knee more? Using this to warm the legs, warm the hip flexors. 
One more each side, and our warm up is over. Great job, guys. Get ready for your intervals. They're up next. Okay, first move is a mid squat, wide squat. Here we go. Mid, wide. We got 20 seconds of this, guys. So knees track toes, butt down and back. Your right foot steps in and out, in and out. Brace your core, keep your posture lifted. All right. So get ready for the quarter turn jump squat. Feet wide, core braced. Let's go, turn, center, turn. So as you turn, bend your knees and sit your butt down. Keep your chest lifted. You don't have to jump here. Check out the option. Good job, breather. All right, so that's one round down. We've got three rounds to go. This time the left foot steps out and in. Ready? Squat, wide. Mid, wide. Oh, sit low, feel the legs burn. This is what it's all about. Getting that burn in the muscle. Woo, almost there. Couple seconds. There it is, all right. Get ready for the quarter turn squat to the right. Stay wide, core strong. Ready? Let's go. Turn, center. So try to stay low. Brace your core as your whole body turns to the front. Oh, that's gonna make your legs burn and your heart rate soar. Good job, breather. Halfway through this, through this round. Get ready for a squat out and in. Mid squat, wide squat. Squat, wider. Oh, the fire burns, that's what she says. That's what we're feeling. Oh, yes it does. Woo, that's what we want, guys. That's the point. Stay here, almost there. Couple seconds. Good, good. All right, ready for your quarter turn squat to the right. Feet wide, core strong. Let's go, turn, turn, center. Remember the pivot option if you need. If you don't like to jump, or if you're just getting too fatigued. Almost there, guys, hang on. Almost there. Don't leave me. Good work. All right. Last round. Mid squat, wide squat. Feet wide. Feet outside the hips. Go. Squat. Wider. Wider. Push the knees out wide. Really activate the outer, outer parts of your butt. Woo. Oh, do you feel that sizzle in your legs? Save me now. Good job. All right, last one. Quarter turn. Jump to the left. Brace the abs. Ready? Let's go. Woo. Turn or pivot. You ready to be done with this round? Come on, stay with me to the finish. Down. Down. The fire burns. Good job, guys. Take one minute to rest.
guys, come onto the floor for your next interval. We have push-ups to back extension. So lie down, hands outside the shoulders. Here we go. Push up, back extension. Push all the way up, back extension. Really squeeze your butt on the back extension. Hands outside, shoulder width. Brace the core as you push the floor away. Option on the knees. All right, come up to a plank. Get ready for a reverse burpee. We're gonna jump wide. Here we go. Jump, jump, back to plank. Feet wide, push off, back to plank. The non-jumping option, we walk. Check out the other version if you don't like to jump. Brace your core so strong here. All right, back down to the floor for your push-up. Hands outside the shoulders. Core is strong. Here we go, push-up, back extension. Really squeeze the butt, fingers to the temples. So really strengthening the body here. The front of the body and the back of the body. All right, push up to plank. On the knees of the toes, ready for your reverse burpee. Let's go. Really push the floor away with your feet. Lock your belly in as you jump back. Burn some calories. Last one. Whew. Come back down to the floor. Round two of four. Hands outside the shoulders. Let's go. Up. So feel it in the front. Feel it in the back. Keep that squeeze on your butt. Come up to your plank. These are toes, core strong. Let's go. Jump wide. Feels so good to get fit, guys. I know it's hard, but you can do it. We're almost there. Whew. Come on down. Last round. Push up to back extension. Brace the core. Let's go. Push. Extend. Push. Still going. Music's quiet. We're still working. Five seconds to go. Come on. Don't give up. All right, back up to your plank. Your last set of reverse burpees. We got this, guys. Brace the core and let's go. 20 seconds of work. Come on. Are you in it to the finish? Remember, we get a big break after this. Last one. Good job. Well done, guys. Take a break.
All right, guys, time for a wall sit. So come against the wall, feet hip distance apart, sit your butt down and back. Brace your core. So we're aiming for 90 degrees at the knees. Option to put the palms together here. If you don't have a wall nearby, do a static squat lunge, like you see on the split screen. All right, come out of that, and we're ready for a Heisman. So feet wide, we're gonna run, lifting the knees high, side to side. Here we go, run. So really lift the knees, push side to side, brace your core. See if you can get your knees up to hip height for a real challenge. Five seconds to go, guys. We can do this. Done. All right, back to your wall sit. Feet hip distance, bend the knees a lot. Ready? Come on down and go. Palms together for, for chest work as well. So this isometric hold really challenges the muscles of our legs. Stabilizing, strengthening. Push your palms together, feel it in your chest as well. Almost done, come on out. Whew. All right, back to the Heisman in five seconds. Feet wide, strengthen the core and go. Push across. Trying to elevate the heart rate here so we can burn fat and calories, burn stress. Get lean. Three seconds. Done. Whew. All right, round two of four. Or three of four. Get ready. Feet hip distance, slide down the wall. And hold. Whew. Can you feel that burn in your legs? Yeah. Let's get comfortable with that feeling. Because that's what getting strong feels like. Five seconds to go, you can do this. Don't give up. All right, good job, come on out. Back to the Heisman. Feet wide, four seconds. Let's go, run. Almost there, keep going. Music's still going, it just got quiet. We can do this. Come on, less than 10 seconds. Pick up those knees. Just a little higher. Almost there. Done. Good job, we got one round. One round to go. Come close to your wall. Feet hip distance, slide down and let's go. Last 20 seconds. The fire will burn. Oh, we can do this. In the muscles. Bring your focus to those quads, to those glutes, to your hamstrings. Two seconds. All right, come on out. Last round. Heisman, feet wide. Come on, find your energy, bring it with you. Let's go. 20 seconds, not even that now. Come on. We're gonna get so strong together, guys. Whether we have the gym or not, we can do this. Two seconds, done. Take a minute to rest. Great job. Next exercise, 
is a backward stepping lunge with the leap together. Of course, you can eliminate the leap. Here we go, right leg, back. So step back, jump together. Option not to jump. Bend your back knee lots, and then push away from the floor. Really strengthening the legs here. Good job, all right. Hammer pull is the next exercise. So feet wide, arms up. Ready, let's go. Pull, so you can jump if you like to, or you can do it with the feet on the floor, just lifting the heels. Keep going, keep going. Don't quit. Come on, you got this. Almost there. Done. Good job. Alternating lunge, start with the left foot. Feet into the hips, left leg ready. Let's go. Lunge, jump, lunge, jump. Really push the floor. Start from the bottom of your lunge and drive up. Non-jumpers, focus on getting low. Yes, we're all building strength in our glutes and our legs. All right, get ready for the hammer pull. Feet wide, hands up. Let's go, go. Roll the hammer down. Imagine you have a 50 pound hammer in your hands. Throw it to the ground. Jump if you like that. Come on, let's get to the end of this, end of the interval. Stay with me, good. Whew. Halfway through, halfway through the round. Right leg ready, step back to lunge. Let's go, jump, jump, keep going. Music just got quiet, still there. Come on, big step, big step, lots of bend. Makes you appreciate the music, doesn't it? Good, good. All right, hammer pull. Feet wide, arms up. Ready? Let's go, go. Come on, get after it. Give it all your energy. You know you get a break coming. Come on, work for that break. Earn it. Push your body. Done. All right, one round. One round to go. Ready to lunge with the left foot. And let's go. Jump. Jump. Yes, you can. Come on. We get strong. We get fit. We get toned. We just feel better. Our body works better. Our everyday activities get easier. Good, good. All right, 20 seconds of work before our long minute break. Arms up. Let's go. Go. Come on. Give it your all. Don't let up. Pedal to the metal to the end of the interval. Come on, you know you can do this. I know you can do this. Be a beast. Done. Take a break. Good work.
with your elbows underneath your shoulders. Abs are braced. You can stay here on the knees or push up to the toes with a long, flat back. Brace your core strongly. Squeeze your butt and your thighs. You only have 10 seconds left. Come on, build strength with me. Almost there. And done. All right, a quick break, and then we're going to do hover jacks or hover walk. So come to your hover and go. So brace the core. Squeeze the butt to try to keep it from bouncing. Option to walk this. Or you can alternate taps with the knees on the floor. Five seconds. Stay with me. Done. Whew. Take a stretch. Come back in for your hover. And let's go. So remember, you can come to the knees anytime if you're feeling fatigued. Come to the toes if you're ready for more intensity. Try to keep that back flat. Less than 10 seconds. Oh, some isometric work. Come on out. Sit back. And come back in for your hover, tap, walk, or jack. Here we go. Try to minimize bouncing through the butt. Of course, it's going to bounce some, but we want to minimize it. Push the forearms firmly into the floor. Five seconds. Halfway. You ready to reset your hover? Here we go. So try not to let your upper back around here. That's tough as we fatigue. So draw your shoulder blades together. Almost there. Five seconds to go. Hold on, hold on. And done. Whew. All right, plank jacks like taps or walks. Get ready, get set. Let's go. They don't have to make big jumps. We're challenging the stability of our core. Driving up the heart rate, burning fat and calories. Five seconds. You can do it. Done. All right. Who's ready for the last round? Come on into your hover and let's go. Oh, come on, fight. Don't let your back sag. Squeeze your butt a lot. Draw the shoulder blades together. Five seconds to go. Oh, we got this, guys. Two, one. Done. All right. Final round. Jacks, taps. Ready? Let's go. 20 seconds to the break. You have a big break coming, so you can work extra hard here. High intensity intervals. How's that intensity level feel? Three seconds. Done. Oh. Great job, guys. Take a minute to rest.
ready for a single leg deadlift. Feet under the hips. Plant your right leg. Here we go. Down, up. So we hinge forward from the hips. You can tap the floor here or not. It's important to take a really big step back and keep your chest lifted. Almost there. Done. All right. Next, we're going to do a surfboard shuffle and a quarter, or a surfboard shuffle and a turn. Here we go. Shuffle, turn, turn. Shuffle back, turn, turn. Shuffle forward, turn, turn. Check out the option if you don't like to jump. Five seconds. Good job. Breather. Whew. Okay. Plant your left foot. Ready for the deadlift? Let's go. Down, up. So take a long step back. We should feel lots of pressure in the standing leg. We're really strengthening the muscles around the knee and the ankle. Two seconds, last one. Good. All right, turn to the left. Ready for your shuffle, turn, turn. Here we go, shuffle, turn, turn. Shuffle back, turn, turn. If you want to bounce, if you don't have a lot of space, all good. Or you can walk it. Yep. Five seconds. Turn, turn. Oh, my legs are burning. How about yours? Done. Good job. We're halfway through our last round. Turn your right foot. Ready for the deadlift. Let's go. So really pull forward from your hips. We're practicing that athletic hip hinge here. While we strengthen our butt, our knees, our ankles. Last one. Done. Face the right. Ready for your shuffle, turn, turn. Here we go. Shuffle, shuffle. Turn, turn. Shuffle back. Turn, turn. Stay low. Brace the core. Remember you can bounce. How about five seconds? Come on. Keep moving. Almost there. Done. Great job. All right. Final round. Deadlift, single leg deadlift. Plant your left foot. Let's go. Down. Down. Can you feel your butt getting stronger? Each rep. Do you need to go slower? That's okay. Do what works for you. Almost there. Done. All right, last, last 20 second interval of the workout. Ready to shuffle? Let's go. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Turn, turn. Shuffle, shuffle back. Turn, turn. So stay low, brace the core. Less than 10 seconds and you're done. Come on, five seconds. Last one, done. Oh, I'm so proud of you. Take a breather. Come back in for core.
Okay guys, time for core. Come on down to your back and let's get started. Bend your knees, lie down, palms up at your sides, brace your core. Get ready for a double leg lift, super slow. Both legs lift, up, two, three, four, and lower the feet slowly. Really brace your core. Keep that low back close to the floor here. Two to your pace, a little faster. Up, up, down, down. If you feel the back arching, brace your core and push it closer to the floor. Fingertips to temple, C crunch. Up for three. Three, two, one. So we add the upper body to the legs. Squeezing ribs toward hips. Two, two, up two, up, up, down, down. Feel the squeeze, feel the brace. Let's fire up the obliques. Single cross crawl, twist to me. Front, back. So keep your elbows wide. Bring your shoulder across the body toward the opposite knee. If that feels good and you want more, extend the legs. So point your toes, squeeze your thighs, and lengthen your legs. If you feel your hips rolling, come back to the toe tap version. Four, three, two. All right, walk your feet in close to your butt. Palms up at your sides. Slow bridge, slowly lift the hips. Slow release. Come again. Squeeze your butt. Push into the heels. Up quick and hold. Up, hold. Slow release. And again. Up. Can you really feel that squeeze in your gluteals? We're going to pulse at the top. Three pulses. Three, two, three. One and down. So extra little squeeze in the top range. Keep going. Try to push your heels through the through the carpet, through the floor. Alright, this time two pulses. Cross the front leg over the back leg. Single leg pulse. Go up, down, up. Oh, single leg bridge, pulsing at the top. That's going to make your butt burn. Brace your core to keep the hips level. Ready to switch feet right here. Switch and go. Up, up. Oh, feeling that in the glute and the hamstring. Eight to go. Eight, seven. You can do this. Both feet down. Slowly lower. Slow. Slowly rise, all the way to the top. Slowly lower. One more time to the top. And drop. Oh, did your butt feel that heavy too? All right, roll on over to the side. Time to train the side body. We're coming to a side hover, so elbow is right underneath the shoulder. Bend your bottom knee and your top leg is long. Lift your hip high. High away from the floor, and then reach your arms straight up to the roof. So you want a straight line from the top of the fingertips all the way down through the elbow. Now squeeze your butt and try to lift your hips just a little higher. It's going to engage those side oblique muscles. With your top, your extended leg, lift it slowly. Up, up. Down, lightly touch. Up, up. Now, if that's too heavy, just keep your foot on the floor. But if you want more, you have two more. This time, up quick, arm overhead, side crunch, elbow to knee. In, out. Oh. So keep that long hip lifted off the floor. And if you can't, you can come back to the static, to the static cover. Otherwise, we have eight to go. 
Oh. Are you guys shaking? I'm shaking. We have four more. Four. Three, but we're not done yet. Two. Point to the floor and pulse the hip up and down. Up, down, up. Oh. We have 16 pulses. If it's too much, just come and take a breather. Take the pulse away. Four more. Four. Three. Two. One. Ah. Man, that's hard. Let's switch sides. Ooh. All right, coming into the side hover. So elbows right underneath the shoulder. Bottom knee is bent and the top leg is long. Now lift your hips up off the floor. So if you feel your shoulder collapsing, I want you to make sure your shoulder is right over the elbow and then really push into the forearm. Are we ready for the leg lift? Top leg, here we go. Up, up, down, tap. Oh. Man, my hips feel heavy. How are you doing? Ooh, we can do this, guys. We can do this. One more slow. Then up quick, arm overhead. Side crunch. Let's go. In, out. Oh. But you know, you did it on the other side. You can do it on this side, too. Oh. We don't quit. We don't quit on our bodies, on ourselves, on our progress. Seven, six, come on, you can do this. Don't give up. Oh, show me your grit. I wish I could see it. All right, top foot to the floor, pulse the hips. We go, 16, 15. Now make sure you're pushing the hip up instead of back. Almost there, almost to the end of the work. Four more. Four, three, now turn, face the floor, come into a hover. Oh, it is 15 seconds. We got this. Workout is almost over. Hang on with me. Drop to the knees if you need. But I think you can do it on the toes. What do you say? Can you join me to the finish? Off, guys let's stretch push your hips back Ooh, reach the arms forward reach your front hand palm up or your back hand palm up under your front shoulder switch direction Bend your left knee and gently hinge your body forward. All right, your right hand comes next to the hips. We're going to lift the hips into a spiral twist. Big reach over the head. Squeeze your butt and push your pelvis toward the screen. Now breathe in and open through the chest as you reach your arm to the opposite corner. Tuck your chin, come down, and switch sides. So bend your knees, come forward. Whew, just enjoy, enjoy the stretch. Enjoy the feeling of accomplishment that I hope you're feeling right now. Left hand comes next to the hips. Squeeze the butt. Lift the hips off the floor. Feel that beautiful stretch to the side of the body. Breathe in and open through the chest. Reaching through the fingertips here. down, tuck your chin, step your right foot forward, clasp your hands behind your back and push your knuckles to the floor, so that hip flexor stretch, switch legs, other foot forward, hip flexor and big stretch over the head, 
Ready to come up to the feet. Come on up. Uh, pick up your right foot. Hug your knees together. Pull that length in the front of the leg. Switch sides. I don't know about you, but man, am I sweating today. Woo, that was a, that was a tough one. Step your foot behind the other. Reach high over the head. And switch sides. All right, let your arm come across, stretching through the shoulder. All those push-ups, all those hovers that we did. Work the shoulders harder. Switch sides. So get your soul gear, guys, at Zazzle.com. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. Take a tricep stretch. And the other side. Oh, I'm so proud of you. Thank you so much, guys. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed the workout. I'll see you next time.